one of my uh, students recently asked, how do I know when it's time to push? Made me think of um, my time in the monastery. Uh, at a certain point in the monastery, you get, you get jobs and one job is the densu. In the Densu, you're in charge of uh, the ceremonies, the chanting, uh, the ringing of the bells, um, ceremonies. And for me, that was just this really wonderful um, time of, of really diving into and connecting with um, my practice in a new way. The jobs are actually quite a gift in the monastery. You think you're there and you're going to you, know, you just want to rake and you just want to uh, work outside, but actually the, the, the jobs can be a real gift, putting the practice into um, the movement in this beautiful way. The Densu are in charge of ringing the bells. And when you see someone uh, ring the bell in a beautiful way, it's, uh, it's, it's really profound. Um, and when you see them ring or you hear them ring the bell, and um, they're unskillful. It's very uh, apparent. The bell is this piece of metal, okay? And, and um, so if we're gonna hit that bell, we hit that bell, and if, if we hit it as this solid object, okay, it can be very vulgar, like just dead, rotten, you know, heavy, um, can feel very vulgar. And, and for me, I saw, oh, and someone's really hitting the bell really well. When I hit the bell really well, it actually ripples. The bell itself ripples. It, it's fluid. It's fluid, okay? And I saw through that that my whole experience of practice was like that. So wherever I had thought things were solid, then I, I begin to see, oh, there there's so many more layers of information, so many more layers of feeling there, okay? And, and to, at that point, my, my practice completely changed from uh, this sort of dead, um, vulgar, unskillful to, my gosh, there's so many layers here for me to explore in my interaction. Everything came alive. My practice started to uh, really change. So the Densu ringing the bell. How can I hit this bell and it ripple? How can I, while I'm walking around, how can I explore reality as this rippling, this uh, connecting, this uh, dynamic conversation with reality?